Good morning, camera. It's Friday. That makes it Film My Life Friday, the Friday in which I film my life, and I have an awesome weekend ahead of me. Tomorrow is Raleigh Pride, which is going to be awesome, and Rachel's coming to town for the weekend, so we're going to get to hang out. And then Monday I'm going to a fucking Kesha concert, and I'm pumped. And then Wednesday I get to go home for fall break, so I have a lot of great things to look forward to. I tell you all this so you don't worry about me when I say how mundane today is going to be because today I'm going to go to class and then I'm going to go do homework and then at some point in all that I'm also going to do laundry and that is literally all I intend to do the entire day. So this is not going to be a terribly exciting video. Now for example I'm on my way to the GOBT Center not to hang out with people but to get an extra hour of sleep and also I misspoke while ordering my coffee this morning, so <laughs> it's rough. It's gonna be a rough one. That's fine. That's life sometimes. I'll work through it. Don't know how interesting it'll be, but honestly, are these ever interesting? Well, they are to me, but that might just be narcissism. <sighs> Here we go. Are you vlogging? This is a thing I do. We discussed this, I didn't know. we? When I was really little, my twin sister would always like, get really sick. Um, when she had stomach flu, and she would have to go to the hospital. So. Anxiety. Is this gonna be in your vlog, Eric? I can edit it out if you wish me to. Hi. <laughs> uh, I did not spend any of my time in the GLBT center sleeping. I spent it watching television and then um, hearing bad memes, which is to say, making conversation with and the people like, in the GLBT center. That's every day. No, some days I sleep. And now class is completely over for the day and for the weekend. Um, there was a class discussion for which I did not remember I needed to prepare, so I, uh, I pulled my participation straight out of my ass, but I think I, uh, I, think I passed it off because um, the subject was subjectivity. It was, it's not hard to BS on that. They didn't get to hang out. Um, but now I'm going to go. I'm going to sit and I'm going to do calculus for at least like five hours and see how far I can get in that. Um, and it probably won't be very far because I'm not good at calculus. It's about two hours later and I realized I have not had solid food that was not mm -hmm. coffee since eight this morning when I had a breakfast sandwich. So my average is about a 60 now which is not what I want. I generally aim for above 70 because, frankly, after that, who cares? I just need to pass this class. I'm not going to be an engineer. Um, so I will probably do more work on it, um, but frankly, no promises to myself or to you. Fifth floor, going down. But for the time being, I just really need food, so. I just remembered that laundry is the thing I mentioned this morning in addition to homework, and, um, Boy howdy, do I have quite a bit of it to do. Now hopefully, my theory is the laundry room will be more or less devoid of life because it is a Friday evening and most people are out doing things so that I can wash my clothes and then for Saturday and Sunday when I'm actually out doing things, I will have clothes. And also, it's starting to smell. Oh, your face. 
arms will come up with God right anyway. And let your hope not be free when you act like you've got enough. See, we've got obsessions. And another 70 minute dryer cycle later, my laundry is actually done. I know because there's an app that lets me track it. Which also would have, if I checked it, let me know that someone had stopped my load earlier, which I am still bitter about. So now, I get to try to fit three major loads of laundry into this one, one load sized basket. And then I get to put it in my room and not fold it all weekend. Now we're solidly back on campus and I'm sitting in the... <laughs> what's this place called? Turlington. Tucker. Those are different places. I'm sitting in the Tucker Lounge. Um, it looks exactly like the own lounge, except for I've actually been in it. Um, and we're about to make artichoke dip? Yeah, we're about to make artichoke dip, because Marcus is attending a party. Also, that guy's name is Marcus. I didn't get the other girl's name. What's the girl's name? Kavia. And Kavia. We're making new friends. Well, you're kind of new. It's been a month. That's new. Yeah. You wouldn't have depreciated too far if you were a car. Depends on the car. We did, in fact, make the artichoke dip, and they are now on their way to their party. Although it occurs to me, I did not film any of that because I have a terrible memory. Also, I was, you know, busy, like, helping in the kitchen, but whatever. Um, now, I'm going to message Sydney because Sydney promised me a cut of, uh, the brownies that were baked earlier, for which I had to loan them a bunch of shit. So, baked goods, yay! Who am I? A nerd, a dork. No, 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 no! no. No! I don't know what you're talking about. You were about to watch me not only throw up on myself, but I went to cardiac arrest and die. And then post it on YouTube. <laughs> yeah, and then post it on oh, straight out to San Francisco. It sucks. So here's your stuff. It didn't burn. It worked fine because the pan actually wasn't hot because it was like one of those reusable pans. And also you were able to use dish towels as oven mitts. That's like yeah, a thing. I didn't know. but. It turns out the pan wasn't even that hot because it was reusable, but we didn't have that spray, so it all kind of sucked to the bottom, but it's fine because- You didn't grease your pan? We didn't have anything to. And we realized after we poured the stuff in, you could do like a light coating of like veg oil and it should work. Didn't think about that. Oh, here you go. That's about as much as you will want because I ate the other half of that and I think I might die. Cool. It's really, really minty. It tastes like- it's really good. Relatable. But you can't eat a lot of it. You'll die. I'm also very minty and awesome. Yeah. We did that thing where you sit and you watch memes for like large periods of time with a friend. It's from 2010. And we fully did not go to the GLBT center, but I did eat the brownie. And also you did do Sonya's laundry. Was the brownie good though? The brownie was great. I didn't Thank think you. it was too much, but I'm also larger you, than you and have not eaten a proper meal yeah, all day. They probably didn't eat as much as I did. Yeah. Um, there's more on Sonya's room. I don't think she's gonna eat the rest of her, so if you want more, you can have some. Yeah. Since 10 feet is my brother's like that. Red Bone is stuck in my head. It's stuck in my head. We spent a good Carl Weezer's voice. We spent a good like half hour watching Red Bone memes. That girl is a real Carl Weezer. It sounded like Carl Weezer. It did. Anyway, the point I was trying to get to, because I am so distractible, yeah. is um, it's near midnight and I want to end the video. So, thank you. That is all. Yeah, see you next week, or however this ends. See you tomorrow, because honestly he'll post this on a Thursday. True. Goodbye. <laughs>